right, so let's get to those who make that music sound greater. If you're on radio, now I'm here in between two of your favorite voices and faces, depending on where you're listening, whether it's R2 on UTV or you're listening to The Drive on OKFM, your man is Abeku Agri Santana. He's one of the finest presenters, broadcast journalists we have. In fact, he's a multi-purpose individual. He's a CEO of Kayato as well. He travels the world every day. We are lucky to have you in Ghana, sir. Absolute pleasure. Thank you, Joe. <laughs> And it's one of the people who inspired me to enter the media industry. But tonight is not about us. It's about music. What are your expectations this evening? Well, I feel so great to be here. 22 years in the industry. 20 years of um, um, Vodafone Ghana Music Awards. And I can, you know, be thankful enough to God that I've been relevant for 22 years. And, and still counting. And still counting. Um, tonight, there are two, I mean, nominations that I'm looking at. All right. The artists of the decade. Because... Uh -huh. All the S's, all the S's, you know, I saw them, I fed them, yeah. I motivated them. So I'll be proud to call myself, you know, Godfather yeah. to see either of them winning. Then the artist of the year, the artist of the year, yeah, the ultimate. So we're expecting a wonderful night and thanks to Chatterhouse for being the strong foundation of Ghana music, the biggest informer you know, revolution, creating job for the youth. So thanks to Vodafone for also holding our back. All right, we'll come back for five seconds of how we can market Ghana music to the rest of the world, since you're in the tourism space as well, Mr. Tourism. But yes, I'm here with Johnny Hughes. This voice, this man, was the host of the Red Carpet last year, and he's, he killed it. He didn't ask one question, though. Who are you wearing? So this year, I reserved it for you, sir. Who are you wearing? It's got to be grandpa. <laughs> I like that. I like that. Someone asked me the same and I said White Chapel. <laughs> but, uh, White Chapel still around? Oh, stop this thing. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, good to have you on here, sir. Good to have you too. I think you're doing a fantastic job. Thank you, sir. And um, I must congratulate Chatterhouse for 20 years doing this. It's been uh, hard, an amazing journey. But in spite of all the bashing sometimes that comes out of ignorance, they have stood the test of time and they keep rewarding musicians. I think that they deserve a big round of applause. Tonight is going to be fantastic. It looks different. Like, I must congratulate them for the dome as well, you know, the speed with which they put it up. But tonight is for the musicians, those who make us happy. At least we can also relax and watch them work for us. Here's your favorite man on TV on New Day every weekday from 6 a.m. till 10. And also on Community Connect on 3FM 92.7. So this is the man, John Hugh. So your favorite category, before I let you go. Uh, gospel Artist of the Year. And who is your money on? I think it's in Centrini, Nyankupong, Hitmaker, Monio, Diana Hamilton. I'd, I'd root for her. You know. Wow, yeah. that's a bold decision. Thank you very much, Johnny. So yes, marketing Ghana music to the rest of the world. Can we do that? Yes, so digitization. I mean, let's go on Spotify. Let's go on Aftown. Let's get our artists to be educated, to know how they can optimize themselves on the digital space. That's it. All right, over to you.